Scottish morning rolls are bread rolls baked at a comparatively high baking temperature so that they will get baked in less than 15 minutes and have a nice deep golden caramelized crust and a very soft and airy crumb. So in this video, let's see how to make the best Scottish morning rolls in an easy method where you don't need to knead the dough and you can enjoy delicious oven fresh bread rolls in less than two and a half hours. So as the first step, let's prepare the dough. I'm pouring in some lukewarm water, water which is not cold nor hot, but just slightly warm. Then I'm adding two tablespoons of sugar, two teaspoons of salt, and two teaspoons of yeast. Stir and mix them all. Now I'm adding melted butter into this. Then adding flour and combine them all together. At this point, the dough may seem dry. Now I'm using my hands and mixing and make sure there are no dry patches left and our dough is evenly hydrated. And now we may feel the dough is very sticky but that's okay. That's how we want our dough to be. It will absorb all those extra moisture and help to develop the gluten strands later. Cover the bowl and let the dough proof for 45 minutes. After 45 minutes, our dough has risen slightly. Now degas the dough and I'm pulling the dough from the sides of the bowl and stretching it and bringing it towards the center so that it will form a round ball. As our dough is sticky, I'm dusting the top with some flour and this will make a big difference and now it will not be sticky and it will be so easy for us to handle the dough. Now let's divide the dough. We can make 9 to 12 rolls with this recipe. Here I'm dividing them into 9 equal parts. We can either eyeball it or can use a kitchen scale. If they are of similar size, they can get baked evenly in the oven and they look more beautiful. Now take each portion, degas the dough and then simply tuck in the edges towards the center and form smooth round balls. I'm covering it with a damp cloth and let the dough balls sit for about 6 to 8 minutes. And now press each dough ball with our hands or using a rolling pin to make the top flatter and place them onto the baking sheet. Even though my pan is big, I'm arranging them closer to get that signature pull apart look and feel of Scottish morning rolls. And now sprinkle the top with some gluten free flour. I'm using rice flour. We can also use a semolina and then cover it with a plastic wrap and let the dough balls sit and rise for 60 minutes. After one hour, our rolls have risen well and they are all ready to go into the oven. 
So place them into a 460 Fahrenheit or 240C preheated oven for 12 to 14 minutes or until the top gets a deep golden brown. After baking, we'll get those beautiful morning rolls that smell amazing. I'm transferring them onto a cooling rack so that the bottom will not trap steam and get soggy and leave it to cool down for 3 to 4 minutes. You can see they are squishy soft, they have a very moist and airy crumb and to keep them soft for longer I like to cover it with a kitchen towel which will help to retain the moistness inside and you can fill it with ham, bacon or homemade square sausage or they are simply delicious even with some plain butter. And if in case you want to make a small batch you can half this recipe Hope you found this recipe simple and easy to make and hope you will make this at home and I'm sure you will love it. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up and please don't forget to share this recipe with your friends and family who love homemade bread and thank you so much for your love and support and thanks for watching this video. See you next time.